Last week we left Grenada and Magda experienced her first sail on Sisu and we headed for Caracal. So you won't notice I'm taking the time to focus. We are two crazies from South Africa, that's Frick and Pietru. We decided to chuck it all and we are now living and sailing full time on our new home, Sisu. Oh, and another add-on to our intro is my twin sister, Magda. We arrived in Tyrol Bay late in the afternoon and this is also the port where we will eventually have to check out of Grenada. But Caracal has so much to offer so we decided we're going to explore a little bit first before actually checking out. And we're going to spend the next couple of days sailing around Caracal. Negotiating to go through reefs here, yeah? so we're going to do a bit of a dog leg, and then we will turn up where all those nice white waves are. We flipped a coin and decided to head around the island anti-clockwise. So the first stop would be Petite Martinique and Petite Saint Vincent, and then we only afterwards discovered that we were bang smack in the middle of lobster country. And if only we knew then what we know now, we should have bought all the lobsters these guys had to offer for us. Because they just got more and more expensive the more north we went. This is Petite Martinique. And just look at all these little boats. <laughs> so many wooden balls to negotiate. Many, 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 many. And we're looking for a place. I could say there is a bar, open bar, but the rest is pretty much closed. I need now to get across to that little island and hopefully can find the space to go through there. This looks like lots of blue sandbanks maybe. Ah, oh, good anchorage then. We just now anchored in this beautiful blue water spot. And there's a bar next to a jetty. A dinghy, the water is so blue. We've not seen this kind of blue for a long time. I'm by myself, wish I could solve your problems You're stuck on my wall like neon paintings And I'm so tired of being honest to everyone by myself I do it so well We were so good at flying, but we can't keep flying We keep getting stuck on the wrong side of the mountain We were so good at trying Swimming with turtles is probably like having dolphins around the boat or sunsets and sunrises. It will just never ever get old. Watching these graceful old dinosaurs is just so amazing. We gave it so many chances. When we saw the signs, we just kept dancing. And the night so we seemed so endless. Thought it would last, now it's in the past. I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm Oh, looks like the facilities are not open to the public. Yeah. 
sorry because we have got lots of money to spend. No, I am not. <laughs> so we are sorry, not you don't need to be sorry. So we're not even allowed to walk on the beach? No. Yo, yo, yo. That's sorry I'm not So in a year's time, we might be able to come back. But for now, they say no go. Now, you don't want to cause any troubles for these people, so we understand. So, back to Sisu we go. Sorry guys, so we will concoct some sort of a cocktail on Sisu. <laughs> you think we should do a blue one? No, I prefer the... Yeah, maybe a blue one. Yes, I change. think we must yep. do a blue, blue one. one. With the, With the blue water. water. Yes, to set the ambiance. Okay, done. So after getting the cold shoulder at Petit St. Vincent, we headed across the bay to Petit Martinique and we landed up in this real local little restaurant which served the most amazing chicken wings. And we got to meet the local fishermen and we bought real cheap lobster. I mean, they were going for like 10 easy a pound, which apparently is a huge bargain. What a lovely evening. Look at this. Now we need to find Tipex. Amazing water. It was such amazing blue waters and reefs all over the place. We just had to go snorkeling the next day. And Magda got to see her first shark ever. Lucky fish, we never saw it. Can't keep flying, we keep getting stuck on the wrong side of the mountain. Taking my time through boxes and light. We were so good at flying, but we can't keep flying. We keep getting stuck on the wrong side of the mountain. We were so good at trying, but we can't keep trying. Cause we only end up on the wrong side of the And apparently Tim's whatever serves the best lobster on the barbie ever, on the brine. This is just the most cutest little bay. Very private, very secluded. We're only three boats here at the moment. With a cute little beach. There's the second boat and that's obviously us. And under there, I assume, is where we'll be chomping away on lobster. But look at this pretty little beach. What a pretty setting. And there is a lagoon and that monohull just pulled in. And Sisu's there behind the blue boat. Sisu's there behind the blue boat. Wanted to go for a beach walk? Yes, our beach walk. We've got our bit of a walk. <laughs> Ugh, soft sand, difficult walking. Okay, let's near the This is typically my kind of place. Ram, 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 ram. Yep, that is Tim's place at Anse La Roche. Serves the most amazing pina coladas and the lobsters were to absolutely die for. Okay, so we're in 
need to go into down and then my tapex over there and this time lock and chain so let us see where and how we can get a taxi hmm. so we did the full circle around the island the last couple of days and we're back in Tyrol Bay in Caracao and it was time for the dreaded PCR tests but we were way early so we had time to kill so we went exploring a little bit in this beautiful little town in search for a bar not sure where Pietro is leading us but it's open it is open very nice very clean place look at that no papers no leaves even well, this is a cute little town not much going on but a lot of cars at least Everywhere you see this. Makes you think. Luckily we go in that direction, so we're good. Signing in. Pietro Magda Look at that Put the sun new stuff Sunset is there And so good <laughs> Decided it's time to go Look at that We have Magda Steering us towards the sunset. Imagine that. Oh, look at that. You've done well. You've done absolutely awesome. Thank you. <laughs> and look at this place. It just looks so bloody awesome. It looks like the vibe is going to be good. And we need to... I think I need a bigger, bigger bow. And that brought us to the end of our stay in Grenada. We had a blast of the time. Is Fiji, here we come. Love, love, love.